there's a vivo video there are videos going viral on tiktok that is generation in america they are upset and they are angry that if rule when rule v way is overturned it's going to mess up their hook up culture you know what hook up means they meet a guy tonight or a girl they hook up they get pregnant they just dump the pregnancy like you take a dump in the toilet so they are upset that they don't want that to happen because if Roe v, when Roe v. Wade is overturned, that means abortion will become illegal in America. Mm -hmm. But my issue with these ladies are, I know there are always a few exceptions with those who are raped. We'll discuss that later on, but let me focus on this one first. Now, we have a sex education because I went to school in New York. So they teach you sex education. Nobody can say you don't know. They have sex education in school. They have all types of birth control, the pill, the stick, the patch on your arms. You got the ejection, all kinds, the shots. They got so many types. They even have something called the morning after pill. So we have so many sex education and so many, um, excuse me, so many different types of birth control. And yet these women still get pregnant. Is it not by choice now, if you ask me? With the exception of those who get raped. So I'm putting that aside. We'll discuss that later. But let's focus on this one. You got birth control pills or you got whatever, whichever birth control method you choose to use. If you use any at all. Mm -hmm. Then you still get pregnant and you want the right to be able to get rid of your pregnancy. So that's why you're upset. It will mess up your whole cup culture. If we didn't have birth control, they will see, they will see people will complain. They don't have birth control. Now you have birth control. Condoms. The men can wear condoms. You can take your pills or your shot or whatever it is. They, you still refuse to do that. American women want the freedom and the liberty to have sex with whomever, whenever, however, wherever, whenever, without the responsibility of procreation. They want sexual freedom and liberty to do anything they want with their bodies, as they claim it is their bodies, without... The responsibility of procreation. They want the freedom and the liberty to do, but if they fail to realize with freedom and liberty comes responsibility. That's when your kids, your young men and young women, little children living in your parents' home. Your parents pay all the bills, they will feed you, they will depending on your age, they will feed you, they will clothe you, they will house you, someone they, they will pay for your education. But once you say you are an adult and you become an adult. And you want the freedom to go live on your own. Does being free and living on your own, does it not come with responsibility? They want their freedom without the responsibility. It doesn't happen. You cannot have freedom without responsibility. With freedom come choices and responsibilities. So you want the freedom to have sex with whomever, wherever, however, whenever. With that freedom and that choice, beloved, comes with responsibility and that responsibility it could lead to procreation it could lead to you getting pregnant and then you want to kill somebody else because why you choose to be free not realizing freedom can also cost you hello am i judging somebody i'm not here to judge but let's talk let's talk beloved all oh, those on uh, tiktok i will put i will do the screenshot or some of the put the post on tiktok they are so upset and angry that it's going to mess them. It's going to mess up the whole cup culture. And I need to even address that. That the fact that we have a society that young women and young men are bragging about. Hook up culture. You see how far the society has fallen? You see how morally deprived we are? You see how morally corrupt we have become? That is something to be proud of. Hook up. I can just go meet somebody, have sex. That's how most of them are walking around. They are mentally and emotionally deranged and damaged they don't know that you sleep around with multiple people you are not only collecting multiple diseases you are also collecting and transferring multiple demons stds sexually transmitted demons i repeat you are collecting stds it's no longer sexually transmitted diseases a sexually transmitted demons and disease you are collecting and transferring. Young men and young women. I mean, they make sex look like you go to the uh, McDonald's, the drive through and you just get some burgers, you finish, you roll up the wrapping and you throw it away. That to them, 
this generation how, how did we get here how did we get here as a society as a culture if this if this doesn't change this will destroy this nation and this is how humanity gets destroyed that's something that should be enjoyed between two couples that are married is like something you can do you meet some dude today you do it tomorrow you meet another dude you do it it's, to them it's nothing but they are damaging and disrupting and, and destroying their soul their cells their spirit at a molecular level at your cellular atomic level you are destroying yourself and you don't even know and they wonder why they are so some of them have anxiety they have depression they are on all these anxiety depression drugs that's why that's one of the reasons that's one of the reasons because your body was not meant to be shared with any and everybody. And if, even if you want the freedom to do that, it's also going to cost you some mental peace, emotional stability, spiritual cleansing, or spiritual filthiness. Any kind of freedom and choice you want, my beloved, freedom and liberty, no matter in whatever area you choose that, it comes with responsibility and it's very costly. But it should not cost somebody else's their lives. Because you want to be free to lay around and sleep around with every Tom, Dick, and Harry. This is Dagnet. Thank you very much. Share this. Subscribe and invite. Let's keep the conversation going. If you don't agree, no problem. But don't come and insult me. Because if you do, I'm very grateful for the black body. I do have a black party once a week. But we can discuss with differences of opinion. We can even disagree professionally, maturely and respectfully no problem with that thank you very much this one heaven sent aren't we all sent from heaven aren't we all sent from i'm heaven sent so are you listen i have this for babies teenagers adults young old because we are all sent from heaven we're all heaven sent and we also were put on this earth to come and turn this earth into a little bit of heaven on earth. To turn it into days of heaven on earth. So order, place your order. Compliments of heaven, heaven sent. You got a little baby, boy, girl, niece, nephew, or for yourself, or your mom, Mother's Day is coming up. Heaven sent. She will love that. And my baby thinks I'm heaven sent. How awesome is that? Isn't it? So let me know, place all your orders, and I really appreciate everyone. I thank you so much. Without those who support the small businesses, I don't know where we're going to be, where we'll be without your help and your support. So thank you so much. Thank you guys. Dagnet, you like my design? I'm on the road today, y'all. I decided to make all my designs, and I decided to model them today. So nice question. I'm not going to say the word because I don't want the video. You understand me? So you can read and place your order. There's going to come a time. These t-shirts, these words, these phrases are going to be very hot. Really, very soon, people will love to have those. That's when you will have the freedom to talk and say whatever you want without censorship. I will have my contact information in the video. Please visit and patronize us. Thank you. It's people like you that keep small businesses alive during this uh, lockdown. I'm not even sure if I can use that word. You like? This is one of my very, very first uh, designs. Well, this t-shirt is kind of old. It's probably two years old now. I'm a warrior, not a warrior. It's kind of old, but it's okay. It still works. I still wear it. So don't forget, place your orders. And we ship anywhere in the U.S., Canada, Australia, U.K., in most parts of Europe. So place your order and you will have your stuff shipped to you with a free gift. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you. I'm back. I've decided today to model and advertise my own products. Of, of course, I lost some customers to purchase and send me the beautiful picture and I'll put it on my website and model you as well. But this is actually one of my very first designs that I made two years ago. It says, I'm the lost battle axe. There's some imperfection right there. But that was my one of my very first. But now, I was an expert. Thank you, guys. I'm looking forward to receiving a lot of orders. Yes. And we ship anywhere in the U.S., 
UK, Australia, Canada, and most parts of Europe. So thank you so much. I really appreciate it. People like you that patronize small businesses. You are a lifesaver. And we thank you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. You like? You like? I like? You like? Isn't it cute? I know at least will, I will start, you know, pumping some iron so I can do small weight. But it don't look too bad, isn't it? This is women. You know, it's not women. I bought this from the kids. This is kids extra large. Yeah, because I have a small frame. Yes, I know I have a little bit of weight on, but I have a small frame. Is this even recording? I have a small frame, but some extra meat on it, you know what I'm saying? You call it fat. But the point is, this is kids extra large. So if you want your t-shirt snug, but depends if you are short. I'm five feet. Mm-hmm.